एवरीवन वेलकम टू माय चैनल माय नेम इज़ कीर्ति आई होप यू ऑल आर डूइंग ग्रेट सो टुडे दिस वीडियो इज़ गोइंग टू बी अबाउट एडवांटेजेस एंड डिसएडवांटेजेस ऑफ बीइंग अ कैबिन क्रू सो दिस वीडियो इज़ गोइंग टू बी ऑन द बेसिस ऑफ माय एक्सपीरियंस एज अ कैबिन क्रू आई वर्क फॉर डोमेस्टिक एयरलाइन वन ऑफ द डोमेस्टिक एयरलाइंस इन इंडिया सो ऑन द बेसिस ऑफ दैट सो विदाउट एनी फर्दर डू लेट्स स्टार्ट विद द वीडियो us join aviation without being aware of the reality most of us join aviation because we are very fascinated about the lifestyle of a cabin crew we are so attracted by the benefits that they get as a cabin crew but always remember a coin has two sides if it has a uh, advantages it definitely has disadvantages as well so before joining any kind of so if if even if you want to join any other field as well you should be aware of the advantages and disadvantages that is it comes with so that's what i'm going to tell you so let's start with advantages that we get as a cabin crew the first and one of my favorite advantages of becoming a cabin crew is that you get to explore so many cities in india like almost all over the india as i told you i work for one of the domestic airlines in india so yes you get to explore almost all over the india and uh, outside india as well so many international destinations are also there you get so many international layovers my first international destination where i went was because of my job because of this job only so i'm grateful for this job because of this i went to my first international destination which was doha and so many others and my favorite advantage of becoming a cabin crew is that you get free tickets for you and for your family from the airline that you work for yes you get you do get free tickets for you and for your family but you have to pay a little amount which is a tax which is uh, like aapko tickets to free mein milti hai but uh, एक एक अमाउंट होता है जो सिर्फ टैक्स होता है वो हमें पे करना होता है अपार्ट फ्रॉम दैट यू आर गोइंग एंड येस ऑफ कोर्स यू गेट टू स्टे इन फाइव स्टार होटल्स फोर स्टार होटल्स वेन एवर यू गेट ले ओवर्स वेदर इट इज़ इन इंडिया और आउटसाइड इंडिया यू गेट टू एक्सप्लोर सो मेनी गुड होटल्स विच आर फाइव स्टार एंड फोर स्टार ओनली एंड दैट एक्सपीरियंस इज ऑब्वियसली वेरी गुड now the next advantage is that you do not fly with same people again and again so why i'm counting it as an advantage because uh, it is not necessary that whenever you fly you will get along with your colleagues on daily basis so it is one of the you know good advantages that you don't get to fly with same people again and again even if you're not getting along with some people even if your vibes are not matching it's you know very rare that you will fly with those people again but now conditions apply so there are so many bases in india of of a particular airline so suppose you are in a big base so you will hardly fly with those people again but if you are in a small base you will fly with them often again and again so next advantage is that you can swap your duties your offs your privilege leaves uh, with other with your fellow crew members now this is also a very good advantage suppose if you are if you have a layover like three day pattern four day pattern you are outside uh, your city your base for three days and four days and suppose your family is coming or your friends are coming or you have some plan in the city so you can definitely give out that layover to other crew member and you can take take day returns day returns means you're going on the same day and coming on the same day from your duty so that you can be in your city or vice versa you can take layovers give layovers you can swap offs if you want and you can swap even your peels which are your leaves which you get like specific amount of peels in a year you can swap those as well so yes this is also a very good advantage because it it makes your job a little flexible next advantage is that career growth in aviation is also fast now if i this is only on the basis of my experience i work for a domestic airline again i'm saying i have no idea about international airline but yes in domestic airline if you are working with a growing airline uh, Uh, then definitely chances of your growth in the company are very fast or uh, but yes because of covid uh, things have changed bahut abhi abhi bahut time lag raha hai growth mein logo ko and so many other things because obviously companies are still recovering their uh, losses so but uh, keeping that aside we have like uh, larger or bigger chances of getting promoted in aviation 
so in short being a cabin crew is not at all a boring job you are going to enjoy this job uh, keeping these advantages in mind and uh, because obviously you are not going to face the same challenges again and again you are going to face different different challenges again and again different experiences different people different cities different food so this is not a boring job you are going to you know uh, get so many different different kind of experiences so as i told you this job will give you different different challenges on daily basis so with that we'll talk about our disadvantages of becoming a cabin crew so i have quite a long list about that so let's start the disadvantage of becoming a cabin crew is that there is no fixed timing for anything because your schedule is such that uh, you know suppose today you have morning flight tomorrow you might have afternoon flight day after you have again early morning flight or maybe day after you have night flight so yeah schedule is like that so you do not have a particular time for eating like lunch uh, breakfast lunch and dinner no aapko jab jab time milega jis hisab se aap manage kar sakte ho aapko us hisab se khana padega there is no fixed timing for your meals and for exercise as well if you want to exercise you have to really take out time for that as well but ek time pe aap daily nahi kar sakte and definitely aapka sleeping pattern jo hai wo bhi bahut idhar udhar ho jata hai because of your job timings because of your flights timing so yes aur in sab cheezon ki wajah se na aapki body thodi fatigue ho jati hai so this is one of the you know biggest disadvantages that we have as a cabin crew you don't have family time now फैमिली टाइम अब आपको मैंने अपना जैसे ये स्केड्यूल बताया है कि ऐसे होता है नॉर्मली ऐसा ही बन के आता है आपका स्केड्यूल इसमें फैमिली टाइम नहीं हो पाता सपोज इवन इफ़ यू गेटिंग टू ऑफ्स इन अ वीक विच यू गेट राइट टू ऑफ्स इन अ वीक बट आप वो दो ऑफ जब आपको मिलेंगे यू वुड वॉन्ट टू रेस्ट इन दैट टाइम मतलब आपको फैमिली के पास देने के लिए टाइम नहीं होगा समटाइम्स यू गेट अ लिटल इरीटेटेड बिकॉज यू आर एग्जॉस्टेड बिकॉज ऑफ योर स्केड्यूल सो योर मूड्स आर ऑल्सो नॉट एट योर बेस्ट सो यू विल नॉट बी एबल टू गिव योर हंड्रेड परसेंट टू योर फैमिली बट दिस इज नॉट द केस विद एवरी वन आई हैव सीन सो मेनी पीपल लाइक मैनेजिंग बोथ द थिंग्स वेरी नाइसली बट मोस्ट ऑफ आर्स यू नो वी फाइंड इट लिटल डिफिकल्ट टू मैनेज आर पर्सनल एंड प्रोफेशनल लाइफ विद फ्लाइंग so because of this job you get so many physical issues as well physical problems like suppose if i talk about myself i have got a little cervical issues from the time i've started flying not right after i started flying but after one year so i see so many people who fly with me they have also got so many physical problems cervical issues back issues and what not other issues as well yes definitely you have to take care of your body you have to take care of what you eat and you have to exercise regularly but schedule is such that you cannot do these things regularly uh, but uh, yes these issues will come along with this job but not with everyone you uh, there are few people who do not get these issues but, but most of us it is a reality most of us get these issues because of pulling and pushing of the carts and uh, bending and so many other physical work that we do yes you tend to get these issues but you really have to take care of your body so the next disadvantage is that sometimes you do not get time to eat or drink as well in flight so suppose you are going for a flight hungry because you don't have time to maybe make food for yourself you have gone for the flight you are serving passengers empty stomach you have not eaten anything you feel like eating you are hungry but your you know roles and responsibilities come first so you are serving the passengers and suppose the flight is very busy like uh, it's a short sector you have served so many passengers and you won't even get time to eat food yourself so yes these kind of flights are also there which are short flights in which you know you have to serve so many passengers but you cannot you know you do not get time to eat or drink as well but these flights are uh, like uh, you do not have to do these kind of flights daily yes sometimes maybe once a week or twice a week yes so but slowly and gradually you know you will learn how to take out time to at least take a bite or grab a bite or drink water another disadvantage of becoming a cabin crew is that you get skin issues you get hair fall issues and physical issues i've already told you skin issues like i got so many skin issues because maybe my skin is very very sensitive and uh, we have to apply makeup on daily basis so few products suit you few few products don't suit you so you have to be very mindful of what you're using on your skin and hair styling yes because of i i love makeup and i love doing hair styling so i used 
used to do so initially when I started flying I used to do so many different different front hair styling because of which I got I lost a lot of hair so yes my uh, density of hair has decreased uh, so it, this is not only the case with me there are some not some so many other crew members who have faced same issues so whenever you start flying uh, see these are this is uh, something that you really can take care you have to take care of your skin uh, while you're flying and your hair as well uh, now the next disadvantage is that you share your hotel rooms with other crew members as i told you you have to share uh, sorry you have to fly with different crew members on daily basis so this is not a disadvantage trust me until or unless you are flying with a crew member or, or a colleague with whom your vibes don't really match or uh, jiske sath aap comfortable feel nahi kar rahe ho maybe it could be your senior as well as your junior doesn't matter but jinke sath aapki vibe match nahi kar rahi hai aur maybe uncomfortable si ek vibe hoti hai na so it it, it becomes very difficult to share room with those people for 3 for 3 days or 4 days even if for a day so yes you really have to you know you will learn a lot through this job like how to how to manage these kind of situations uncertainty of schedule is the another disadvantage uncertainty as in uh, like suppose you have standby tomorrow you have come from the flight today and tomorrow you have standby home standby you are supposed to be at your home you are not supposed to go outside uh, for anything because you can get pulled out for any flight any moment whenever they require so you cannot make any plans uh, on that day because uh, you never know you might get pulled out for a flight so yes this is another disadvantage and the another one is uh, stress management agar aap stress manage karna nahi jante hain acche se to ye thoda sa aapke liye shuru mein difficult hone wala hai but obviously slowly and gradually you will learn how to manage all the things you will learn trust me or not but you will but uh, initially you might face some difficulties um, that uh, how to manage your personal and professional life and how to manage the challenges uh, that uh, this job comes with so keeping these disadvantages in mind i that is why i always say this that this job is not all about serving people it's much much more than that trust me i have learned one big thing through this job that you should never ever judge anyone's occupation because every occupation everything requires some kind of effort some kind of uh, motivation dedication hard work in it so never ever judge anyone's occupation beat anything the more i'm growing the more i'm getting older i'm becoming less judgmental about people about uh, their occupation So yes this was the uh, advantages and disadvantages of becoming a cabin crew and keeping these things in mind you can you know make your mind whether you are ready for all these things and uh, obviously everyone will have everyone will face different different kind of uh, situations everyone will have different experiences not necessarily that you will face the same kind of experiences that i have faced so all the very best for your interview Thank you so much for watching this video and uh, I shall see you next time if you have not subscribed to my channel please take out a moment to subscribe to my channel and motivate me to upload more videos thank you so much i shall see you next